again. Again. Good. Again. Good. Again. See how, see that? Okay. See how it's falling into your body? There you go. Okay. Again. Let it fall in more. Good. Let it, fall, let it fall in before you come down. Before you come down, let it fall in. Let, let me do one. You do one. Here. Let's do it together. Stay right there. Which one, George? All right. No. You stand over here. I'll stand here. Okay. No. It's this. It's off here. Okay. This. This. this do the same thing. You start at the same time. Go, go ahead and go. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna go to here and stop. Look. I'm gonna stop right here. Okay. Do it again. So, take a look at that. so the whole thing you're trying to get at is that the feeling here? That's the feeling, but you're watch watch what I'm going versus what you're doing. Okay. Maybe you can see it a little different here, different different view. Okay. I can't change it. So I'm fully caught. Yeah, I didn't even cock my hand. And then I come in. See that? Okay, and see, I'm only going to there, watch. Okay, let's go do it again. So it's almost like you're. We do the work. Oh, okay. No. Oh, you want back that far? Yeah. Okay. Take it back again. No. Again. Stop. Do it again. Take it back and stop. Okay. And then stop. Then do it. Now you got it. Okay. And just take it back quarter of the ways. If it's been cock your wrist and stop. Now go. Now. Okay. Do it again. Good. Okay. Now, now when, when, you, when you stop, and when you make that move, go through the ball, see what happens. Take a practice one. Take it back and stop. Cock your wrist. Now go. Now watch this. Watch the difference then. See, you understand why you couldn't do that if your hands were tight and your arms were tight? Yeah. Okay. You can see the, the transition. Now watch this. Here's the last one you did. Oh, uh, there it is. Not sliding a lot, but who cares? You're not sliding. Don't think your hips too far. Well, no, we haven't. Te I haven't. I've never tested yet. I know. I don't know if you're a slider or a rotator. I won't know till I test you. I'm not going to test you until Got you know. Got no rush, please. Yeah. No rush. Testing you is going to be really important. We don't know if you're a short plane coming down or a shaft plane coming down. I won't know that yet. Now, take it back and stop. Hit a shot. Put the ball there. Now do a half swing. Take it back and stop. Hinge your wrist. Stop. Hinge. Now down cock. There you go. Watch. There you go. And look how, look how much more softer you are. I, I can see it in your arms and your hands. Watch this. There you go. What? See? How about that? Shit, look what that shaft is compared to before. You know you're going to see a good impact. There you go. See? You just get through it. There you go. There's your golf swing. Definitely better. Definitely. Well, your dad's going to like that. See that, Dad? Huh? <laughs> hey, Pop. Get your money's worth. Remember, you remember, Dad. You're his dad. I'm going to top on your t-shirt. Let's <laughs> do it again. Do it again. Oh my god, now stop, down cock your wrist, strike the ball. See what happens. That's where I was getting tripped up on the transition. I was trying to make it all That's in okay. one. That's okay. And I was forgetting to actually hinge. I was just transitioning. 
Soft, cock. Okay, do it again. <coughs> okay, again, not bad. Do it back again. Get it this way, where's the ball going to go? Right. Yeah. right. You got to turn that left hand down. Can I actually pause in a real swing here? Yeah, absolutely. You don't need to be in a hurry to hit the ball. Just take it back, soften up the arms, pause, down cock the wrist. There you go. I still feel it. Fight, fight myself. That's all right. That's all right. Keep going. Play the ball more off your left ear. Don't play it back in your stance. Now, what happens is, you're doing a good job, except you're hitting off, your, your, you're falling back. So instead of saying you're, you're, you're doing this, and then you're going back, and you're hitting back here, you, you still you want to do the same thing, and get on top of it, see? Get on top of the ball more. Okay. Yeah, I felt that. You get your body more. It's not about, it's thrusting your arms. My thoughts are over here with the hinging and okay. transition. Yeah, thing again. Take it back, halfway back, now down cock. See? Now, how much different does that feel? A lot. Now, watch the difference. You got to well, feel I the compression. Did. You actually feel the compression on the ball. Yeah, you because you don't, you're not using your body. Right. The way you should use your body. Yeah, the first little drill. So that's good. I mean, it's good. It's a lot better. It's all body. But it's not as good as what you're going to see here. What I did to here, watch. That's much more into your left side of your body. <coughs> That's so good there. Hands are still a little behind. No, not bad. Not, not bad. I'll take that. I'm used to it. We'll take that. Take it. Soften them up. Just let the shaft fall in. Remember we did a broom drill over there. Yeah. Okay. Now. Now, do you understand the broom drill better? Of course. Huh? Do you understand <coughs> the broom drill? Okay. So watch it. Now you understand the broom drill better. Look. I don't let it fall in. Right. Look. Okay. See, so it's falling in. And when it's falling in, I'm taking my left hand and squaring it up. Look. Okay? Right. So you do that. Remember last time the, the broom was so far to the right? Yeah. Square it up. Take it back and fall in. Good. Take it back further than that. Okay. It's almost a three. So, yeah. Take it back, yeah, take it a little further back. Good. And as soon as, as soon as you get into here, turn that hand up. Okay, do it again. You're late. Turn it down. You, you can't do the broom unless you take the fuller swing. The broom's for more like a driver and three wood. Take it back again. Okay, again. I don't want to get ahead of it. Feel like your knuckles are facing the ground. You get that back. Let's do it. Let's drop the broom in. You're way too late to do it. Now. Okay. Okay. Do it again. Drop it in. Let's go see what see what the face is going to be here. There's your line. Okay. Better than before. Yeah, that looks good. See, there you go. Here's the last one you did. There you go. There's your line of compression. There's your finish. See, see, you're starting to get it. Go back to this now. The whole thing is where I'm really getting having a hard time is making this all one. Right. Should it be one? Yeah. Does it look like it's one right now? Sure it does. 
Yeah. It feels like it's two, but it's I actually really don't have to stop. No. That doesn't work. No, you don't need to stop. Just take it back, 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 back. I mean, when you feel the hands soften them up, just let it fall down. Let it fall down. Remember, you're attacking the ball. You're not falling back. You're attacking the ball. Try it again. You got to attack the ball. Get on top of the ball. Try it again. It's the body to thrust the arm, right? <coughs> right. Attack the ball. Like it in there. Back. See? There you go. That's more like it. And if the ball goes right, say, okay, I didn't quite get the hand down, right? Yeah, try it again. Didn't quite get it down. Soft, up, good. You're going to be shocked next time you play how good your ball strike is going to be. Yeah, no you can feel it now, can't you? Oh, yeah. I mean, there's a scoop and all the distance loss. So let's just stay today, let's stay with stage one to stage two. And then you're actually doing stage three, don't realize it. And um, so if you wanted to add something to that, you could go, okay, stage one. It's going to be no wrist caught to here. See? Okay. Okay, no wrist caught to here. Using your body. See? You have four, my ball isn't. Okay. And then we're going to add a hinge to it. We'll take it back to here. Have a little hinge and still have the same, same finish, follow through right to here. We'll take it back a little bit further. When you took it back further, what did you add? You had a shoulder turn to it. That's why you're popping the ball more, see? Hinge, shoulder turn, there's your leg, there's your follow through. That's right. it. Right. And then if you wanted to add, you could go to a sh this short hinge with no shoulder turn and do this, see? What is that, the Rotation. Cut, coming through Rotate, the right. Well, see, so take this rod here, put it outside your ankle. Yeah, right about there. Okay, I'm going to match that rod up. Watch. Okay, a little hinge here. Look. Right there. See, so what am I teaching? Right, so instead of just stopping now, you're doing the same thing, except, okay, let's do the same thing. Let's go ahead now, give me the, 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 the short wrist hinge drill, light it in there, and that's the rod up. Trust the ball, give me the leg. See you do it. Ready? I hit one? Yeah. yeah. Match, it, match it up. Soften those wrists up. Just drop it in, remember? Soften the wrists up. Back, in. Uh, now, rush it. Where'd the ball go? Left or straight? Left. Okay. Try it again. Rush it a lot. You didn't even cock your wrist going back. Soften those wrists up. Are we going, how far back am I going? Uh, just to your pocket, just adding a little hinge to it. We get a chip, and we're going to do a little hinge. A little better, try it again. Soften them up. Let's just take a look. Let's see. Let's see where we're at right now with this. Yeah, I'm having a tough time with that. You got to drop. You got to soften those arms up. Shaft's got to fall into you. Yeah, I'm not letting it fall in. I can feel it. Let's go to the second last two. Yep. Yeah, 
So here's your flip. Yeah. Okay, see the last one. But when you're letting it fall in, are you moving at the same time? Towards the Well, bottom? yeah, you're moving. Look, you're moving. That shaft's falling in. So you're doing good. That's pretty good there. See? And, and then you add your right hand to it. See? But that's okay. You're still in pretty good position to the golf swing. So that's that's about 80%. That's pretty good. I mean, I'm happy with that. Right again. You come back with that next time. We're gonna we're 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 getting there. Okay. You can see earlier the softer the better. Now every time you, when you took it back before and you stopped, you did it better. So just let the shaft come in. Down cock in. Take it back and stop. Down cock in. Okay. Do it again. So all you're doing is pulling your arms down. Okay. Do it. Take it back in. Hold it there. Now, you've got to use your wrist to bring it in. It's not pull your arm down, it's this. It's, it's the softness of the wrist. See, that does nothing. You can still do this and cast. See, when I'm taking it back, I'm not going this way. I'm going this way. I'm just taking my wrist and coming back more with the so soft creating more wrist pressure? Yeah, with your right hand, left hand, left hand, both hands. Like that. That's what you uh, got to do. Okay, so create more wrist pressure. That's what you did earlier in your swing. Now you're, you're going. You're not doing as much. And hit a ball like that. And then you're <coughs> trying, just trying to handle through it. And cock him. Hinge. There you go. That's, that's back to where you were earlier. Yeah, I can feel it. So I know you had a little bit more softer wrist coming in the ball. Let's think about creating more pressure right. on the way down. That was very good. Try it again. Very good. Good. Yeah. Feel better? Yep. Yeah. yeah, I think I can start to control it a little now. <coughs> Do the chip. No wrist caught. <laughs> Pull the handle back, no wrist cocks, down cock. Okay, don't oh, why you rush it, don't rush it. Just hit over top of the pillow. Are we doing stage one? The yeah, one stage one. one. The chip. Pull the handle back. There you go, that's good. Now it's good I can fall it. back to get that feeling on it. Add a wrist cock to it now. Nice. <coughs> nice. Try it again. Very you nice. You could see it from right there. Huh? You could, you could tell from Absolutely. Right? I don't need, I could see it from a tree up there. <laughs> Soft the rest of them. Pull it back. Pull it back. Cock. Good. Now watch. Yeah, it's much better. Should I get the best eyes in golf? I can tell. You could sit there and tell. Nobody has eyes like me. Yeah, so many golf pros come here and watch me teach. You said, "How like you see that?" <laughs> I was surprised you could see. Okay. There, look, there you go. Look. That's the that's drill, right? Yeah. yeah there's number your one, I got that. I got number two, I got. Here's here's the. Uh, it's pretty good there. See. What's the last one you hit here? There's your, there's your leg, see? Look. There's your compression. There you go. I told you I saw it. That was a deep half swing, though. That was the drill, right? That, right, that was the chip drill. That was the chip drill, yeah. 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 Do, the, do the half swing drill. That's where I'm still getting a little confused back here. Just feel like you're the same thing. Your wrists are cocking in. Like, part of me wants to do a full loop here, all in one motion. But I don't know if that's right or not, and then I want to. It's everything's right as long as you're not pulling the club down. You let the wrist soften it up, like that. That's what you got to do. It's all in your wrist. The wrist's going to create the lag, not your pulling your arms down. It's the soft wrist, oh, it's like that. There you go. So again, hit one like that now. Give me replicate that same feel, and then turn through it. All right. So don't pull the club. Okay. Soften them up. Pull the handle back softly. Cock your wrist up. Okay, good. Let's look at that. The only thing that could be better would be hitting on your left foot instead of staying back on your right side. And that's, that's why you don't feel the compression. That's exactly right. Even though you did a good job here. So 
thing. You're going to see down cocking right there. Look. There you go. See, you never saw it before in your swine. Look at that. No. Okay. That That's excellent. Yeah. That's but then you stay there. So your left knee's collapsing, your left knee's collapsing, your right foot's still on the ground. See? So, you know, hitting off your back foot is not the answer. Okay. So but, but, you had it down cocking. Okay, the next time you see me, you want to see yeah. off the foot. I want to see, and the I, down want, I want to see that. See? Huh? Not that. Can I be finished with that all the way here, I guess? No, no, just a little bit. We're, we're already going to full follow through. Full follow through. Watch my right leg. Nice shot here. Look. Look. See? There it is. It's not, it's not this. But the niche flag is, see? This is firming up. Right there. Okay. This is firming up. Your right leg. Yeah, right leg's firming up. Left leg's actually firming up. The right leg is raising up, too. But you got to. Hit against that real nice firm left leg.